Here's a red letter date in the history of science. November 5th, 1955. I'm sure most of you know this scene from Back to the Future. Today we are here. 22nd October 2020 will be a red letter day in the history of the world because today this happened. Literally it, just pull that Oh, out. look at your screen. Dude. It's, it's, just, lit it's literally like red lasers, but it literally sees everything. It has all the cars literally on it. All right. Hey, let's go. Let's go. Put this bad boy in drive. Where did you navigate to? Uh, Target. Oh, okay. Wait, it's going? Oh, it's going, dude. But there's no lane. There's no lanes. <laughs> oh, my. There's cars on the side of the oh, road. Dude, it's navigating through it all, bro. All right, here we come up to the first the first turn, dude. No. Blinker no. is on, dude. Oh, blinker's on. My mind is about to be blown, bro. Okay, here no we go. Oh, no way, dude. Oh, it, it paused to look. <laughs> it paused to look, dude. Wait. No way, dude. There's no lanes. Oh, my gosh, dude. Okay, here we are. It's going to speed limit, too, dude. Elon, right. you madman. Wait, but wait, there's cars on the side of the road and there's no lane markings, though. Oh, dude, you oh, trip it out. Oh. oh, 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 okay, okay, we good. Oh, we we good? good. Oh, good? it's navigating around the car. You didn't do that. You didn't do oh, that. I didn't do it. Dude, I'm not doing anything other than being very cautious, Elon. You're a mad. I think the world will never be the same again. Like everyone else, I asked Elon Musk this question, among many others. Worldwide beta release soon. And Elon was super kind to reply to my tweet. He said, as soon as we get complete testing and regulators approved. So many different traffic signs, rules and languages around the world, not to mention driving on left side of the road. Also, a long, challenging road lies ahead, getting into high nines reliability, way beyond humans. Despite that Elon reply, I was a bit bummed because I hoped for an Aussie beta release soon. So what is this all about? Let's jump right in. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is Nash from Tesla and the Gong. Today, Tesla released the beta version of their full self-driving software to a special set of customers. I'm extremely happy that it was John of Tesla owners Silicon Valley and Raj of Tesla Raj who released the first video of their reaction to Tesla's FSD beta version. John's Model X got the update 2020.40.8.10 which had the FSD beta program update. Very, very special indeed. More so, because there is no embargo on John sharing the news with all of us. So we got to see all of their reactions and some of the videos as well. I am deliberately using low resolution video and low resolution screen grab because I want you to go and follow these two guys. Tesla Raj who makes some fantastic YouTube videos and Tesla Owners Club Silicon Valley John who has some fabulous content as well. Here John demos the left turn that the car makes on FSD. I am blown away looking at it. No way! No way, dude! Wow! What? No hands on the steering no wheel. No hands on. Oh my! Wow! Full self-driving. Here good. we are. Beta is amazing. Here we see the right turn that the car makes all by itself. I'm amazed, to be honest. person visualization we have our friend going around the car you can see he's walking around the other person who posted the videos was a Twitter user by handle name Brandon Nee 916 who had the update on his model 3 fantastic videos I give them all the credit and that is why I posted just low resolution videos because I want you all to go to their channel I must say this FSD visualization is so psychedelic this is not like what we are used to seeing, isn't it? It's not the refined, clean renders that we're used to seeing. This is what the car actually perceives and recognizes as objects. It is simply, simply stunning. I'm really impressed by what the car is able to do. And this is just beta number one. 
Now think of what it would be when it has a wide release. Now the question on every Aussie's mind is, what happens to our roundabouts? And that question is partially answered here. The car is overcautious at the roundabout as Brandon e puts in his tweet and I can see that it takes a while for it to cross this although there are no cars on either side. Still learning but we will get there. This is still an awesome first beta look. And while we stood mesmerized by all of the videos and all of the tweets about FSD, Elon Musk dropped this bombshell. He said now that Tesla FSD beta is out in limited release, FSD price, new or upgraded, will go up by $2,000 on Monday. In Australia, the full self-driving package is $10,100 Australian dollars. It is a massive sum of money. But having seen what the FSD can do, I think it's a massive investment, particularly if you're thinking about RoboTaxi. And Elon did talk about that in the earnings call this morning as well. We were not sure if this price hike was going to be worldwide or just for the US, but we did get a clarification to that because Viv did tweet out to Elon again and said only in the US or worldwide, given the regulatory restrictions are still in place and I believe FSD beta is US only for now. Price should only go up when functionality is the same as in the US. And Elon said, sure. So the price hike is imminent, but our price hike has not happened yet. So that's good. If you want to buy FSD, it's still 10,100 Australian dollars. So if you want to step on that, and if you're convinced by what you saw on this video or on the Twitterverse, please do buy that FSD right away. Now, what do you guys think? Are you impressed? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I must say I have never been this jealous of any human being in my life because these guys who got this FSD beta update are in the precipice of massive change in the way the world looks at driving again. This changes everything one more time and this is mind-blowing. This is National Tesla The Gong signing off. Peace.